Welcome back to my channel, guys. That made a really weird noise. It is really hot in my house right now, and I just was dancing to Kesha. Today, we are trying on hand-me-downs, and I am very excited because I absolutely love hand-me-downs they're my favorite types of clothes to get you guys have already known this i've done two videos trying on hand-me-downs so yeah i'm just really excited um the first thing that i saw in this was this bathing suit and i really i don't think i'm gonna fit in it because it's pretty big but i love i absolutely love the pattern i have a guest here with me today let me show you him he is on the other side of the camera and he's getting excited because i'm talking about it the heck kind of body movement is that? I'm gonna just get right into it. Let's try on... Actually, I don't even know what's in this bag besides this. So we have some sports shorts. I don't even really need to try these on. I could try them on over my shorts. Cute, stylish. We'll definitely be wearing these to work. This is the front of the next one. And then this is the back. This is what she looks like on. This one's super cute. I don't really wear these shirts that much anymore, but am I gonna keep it? Probably. Ooh, okay. We have some bathing suit bottoms, some more bathing suit bottoms. Quiet Storm, this looks like it's gonna be too small for me, but we shall try it on. This is the front, and then this is the back. This one actually fits pretty nicely, so this is the front. This is the back. I'm going to say no to this one actually. It's super comfortable and it actually fits really well. But I have so many t-shirts and I think if I had another t-shirt, I would don't know where I would put it because my t-shirt drawer is literally so full and my closet is also filled with t-shirts right now. Black bottoms. These are so cute. They're like little pink marble bottoms. Oh my gosh. This is another pair. These look like my butt are going to be out. Like this is the whole back. <laughs> but we will try them on later. Here's some more black bottoms. Okay, this top definitely is not going to fit me. Because my boobs are not that big. But I'll try it on later just in case. And then we have these pink flamingo bottoms. These honestly look like underwear to be honest. This is the next thing. This is super cute. This is a sweater. I'm gonna go try it on. This is what it looks like. I absolutely love this. I will definitely wear this all the time in the winter. And also, it could be kind of like, you know, when you go to the beach in the morning or like on the boardwalk at night and it's like kind of cold. This could be something that you wear on those days. This is the next one. It has a little wave and like tropical flowers on the front. And then this is the back design. This is what it looks like on. And again, because I have so many t-shirts, I'm gonna have to say no to this one, but it is super comfy. I just honestly don't think that I would like wear it a lot. So that's probably why I'm not gonna keep it. This is the next one. It looks like it's a dress. And it's from Billabong. This is what she looks like. Super cute. The back is definitely the most open part. It is a little big, I'm not gonna lie. And I feel like it is supposed to be like down further in the front, but I don't really want that to be the case. I feel like this is definitely something that I would wear, especially like at the beach. But I just have a weird feeling that I'm just like never gonna wear it. I am going to say no to this one just because I feel like it is a little bit revealing. Like literally if I bend over, you could see everything down my shirt right now. And I feel like the back is just a little big. And I feel like I am never going to wear this because I don't really feel comfortable in it. Although I absolutely love the pattern of this in the front and also in the back, like the sleeves and stuff. And I also do admire that the back is actually longer than the front. So, because like, I feel like that makes sense for girls to have dresses that are longer in the back because like our butt takes up a little bit of space. So I do admire the design of this dress. This is the next shirt and it just crosses in the back. This is what it looks like on. 
again this one is really like low cut and I'm not really into that so this one is going in the no pile this is the next shirt and as you guys know I absolutely love like shirts that are this kind of style however I don't know if this pattern is going to look good on me again with this one like it's really low cut um I mean, I absolutely love the style of it still. And it also is a little, it's like tight around the bottom, which I don't really understand. But it was like a little difficult to like put on, if you know what I mean. I really do love this shirt, but I just know that I'm going to feel uncomfortable. Like, because literally if you bend over, like you can see right down your shirt. And I'm not that kind of like girl, you know what I'm saying? This is the next shirt and I have a feeling that I am absolutely going to love this one. This is the next one. I absolutely love the top of this shirt. The only thing is that it's like skin tight around the stomach area. You could also wear it like, never mind. Definitely don't wear it up there. I am going to say no to this one. I, I just don't like skin tight. I feel like I'm saying no to all of them. I do really like a lot of them. I just don't like feel comfortable in them. You know what I'm saying? Here is the next one. This one is super cute and I can definitely see myself wearing this one. I feel like if I had a different bralette on, it would like be able to look better. Um, I'm going to say yes to this one because I do think that I would wear it. I just feel like it looks weird with this bralette. If I had a bralette that went around my neck, it would probably be better, but yeah. This is the next one. It's kind of just like a tie-dye print and it's like off the shoulder. Um, I don't really think I would ever wear this. It totally is cute and I love the pattern and I really thought that I might like it, but I just really don't think that I will ever wear it. This is the next one. It's just a plain pink t-shirt. Again, I really don't think that I will wear this, so it's a no. This is the next one. It's just a white cami. No way. I just found these in the bag. I am excited. I am going to say no to this white cami. I feel like this would be like a good cover up on the beach. You know, cause you can see right through it clearly. But I already have like three beach cover-ups, so I really don't need any more. I am going to keep this, and the reason that I'm going to is because this reminds me of like a movie, where like you go to the beach and you wake up with like your significant other, and you like go out on your deck, and have like coffee and look at the beach. <laughs> And even though I don't need any more beach cover-ups or shirts like this or like nighttime shirts or whatever, we will be watching the sunrise like many days out of the week that we're down at the beach. And I feel like this is a perfect shirt to like go down to the beach, relax, watch the sunrise. So I will be keeping this one. At least for this summer, if I don't wear it this summer, then I'll get rid of it. Here's the next shirt. This is definitely my color. Like these are literally my two favorite colors is this like orangey peachy color. It's like pretty much the same color as all my nails right now. And then this blue. I'll keep it, why not? Because if I don't end up wearing it, then I can just, you know. But if I do end up really liking it and wearing it, then that's another piece of clothing that I love. This is the next t-shirt. This one's very like plain and simple and I love that because you can wear it with a lot of like other different things. So I am gonna keep this one. And then we have this flannel, which just so happens to go perfectly with this gray shirt. So this gray shirt and this flannel is definitely going to be an outfit. I've already planned it. They're so cute. Look at them. I absolutely love these. We also have these heels. This is what they look like. They are pretty, but I already have a bunch of dress shoes that I can wear like to prom and stuff and I don't really wear heels that much. So these are going to in the no pile. I am going to step off camera and try on all of these bathing suits and then I'll come back and let you know how it went. Okay, so I picked the bathing suits that I wanted and the bathing suits that I did not. So I'll go through the ones that I did not want first. The first one was these white bottoms and I was actually really excited about these. 
However, there was a lot of butt and they were way too small. There's like no stretch at all to them. Um, so there was no way I was fitting into them. Then these, which I actually really liked the pattern and the color when I put them on me. At first I was like, these kind of look like children's underwear, but I put them on and I actually like really liked it. However, it is a little bit too small and I can't even, like these things are like so tight, like the ties on the side that I don't even want to try to like get them undone because honestly, if I could get them undone, it probably would be fine and I could like fit fine, but they are still too, like a little bit too small. This top was way too big. I actually tried to like fit it on my body and like tie it tight so that it would fit. But then there's like this metal piece in the middle that was just like stabbing me in the chest. And I did not like that very much. This top was also too big. Now onto the ones that I am keeping. So the first ones are just these black bottoms. Then I'm keeping these pink bottoms and they actually go with that matching top, but I'm just gonna keep the bottoms. Then these black bottoms, they're pretty much the same as the other ones, except the other ones has like a like fringe down the back of the butt. These bottoms, which these are actually the most comfortable bathing suit bottoms I have ever worn. And then these, and those are all the bathing suits. Now I'm just gonna quickly like go through a rundown of like all the things that I'm keeping and all the things that I will not be keeping. So the first thing that I am not keeping are these heels, this white top, this pink t-shirt, this blue shirt, this top, this shirt, this shirt, this dress, this t-shirt, and this t-shirt. I'm low-key debating whether I should put this one in the no pile also because I had like a couple shirts like this like last year and I just like never ended up wearing them. I mean, it's not like I'm buying the shirt. Like if I was buying the shirt, that would be a different story, but I could just like see if I wear it, if I like put it in my closet and stuff. But to be honest, in the winter time, I wear a lot of like sweatshirts. Like that's pretty much all I wear in the winter time is just sweatshirts. So I just don't want this to like go to the back of my closet, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, this is the first one that I'm going to be keeping and we'll see how it goes. This gray shirt, this large see-through shirt, this black off the shoulder. Oh my gosh. Guys, look at my dog. He is all bundled up there. That is hilarious. This red striped shirt, this pink sweater, these flip-flops, these shorts, this flannel and this shirt all right that is all i have for you guys i just realized that this is the first video that i'm doing officially with my hair blonde um if you have not seen my vlog where i get my hair done definitely check that out if you want to but i was not a blonde like a week ago thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoy this video you guys always seem to like these type of videos um i will see you guys in my next video have a blessed day